Scoo, can you see me? I is the time now? Yes, yes, yes! Scott? Yeah? What the heck is this? Well, play sets are kind of a lost art nowadays. That's true. When we were growing up, you know, there was generally at least one play set in every line. But nowadays, you know, for whatever reason, they just don't make them. They're kind of big, they take up a lot of shelf space, but there are still a few examples of this dying art <laughs> left over. And what we have here is one of them. Uh, which is the WWE Electronic Entrance Playset. What kind of details have we got in this? Well, we've got a lot of different action features here. What I'm actually going to do is be a real pain, and we're going to take a look at the backside first, so let's spin it around. So one of the cool things about this playset is that it not only covers the entrance, it also covers backstage as well. Oh, cool. So what we've got here is we've got a little bit of an area where you can go and hang out before you actually enter the ring. We've also got this sort of office type area. A lot of the time it'll be a case of somebody's in an office talking to somebody else about the match which is coming up. And Someone usually comes in and starts punching them in the face and exactly. things like that. Exactly, yeah. So let's take young Mr. Daniel Bryan here. Yes! We've got a little ladder that he can climb up to get to the next level. Yeah. Oh my god, he's in Vince McMahon's office and Vincent McMahon is going to tell him what's going on here. Arr, I don't like you, you're a vegan and you're not a bodybuilder. Arr. Yes! Let's just say... Mankind and Daniel Bryan are going to fight out on this level here. And you might feel that they're fighting and it's just not intense enough, so let's take it up to another level. <laughs> up to the very tip top here. Oh no! Oh. It collapses and this actually smashes through the glass that we have here on the entranceway. Yes! So we're back around the front now. Yeah. We've got this nice little platform here right in front of the Titan Tron. So if you actually let it go forward, he falls and smash. Mm. He will break the stage and also the ramp as well. <laughs> okay, so that's designed to break. Absolutely, and this guy here is broken as well, but it's, it's a bit foldy, so he's awesome, he can survive anything. Now you do have this little WWE logo here. Yeah. And we do have these little searchlights here, which don't actually move, they're just, just there. And there's a little button just inside this little section here. With where a foot presses that, oh. and hey! It's gone all red. The lights are going, he can come out, and everybody's going, yes, yes, yes! No! And of course up here, you know, the Titan Tron is usually where they have a wrestler's entrance video, which mm -hmm. plays at the same time as the music going. They've got this nice little cardboard insert here with John Cena making a sign, going, hey, I'm John Cena. Yeah. Uh, and you can actually take that out if you don't want to have John Cena up there. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't look very good if you just leave it blank. So this is the feature that I really like about it. If you take your tablet, and you download a specific app, which is for WWE entrances. You just select it mm -hmm. and hit play. And it will now play Daniel Bryan's entrance video. Nice integration of technology there. Absolutely. I mean, it's your own technology. You have to provide your own technology, but that's fine. But it's cool that they have that ability to integrate it. Having a playset with wrestling makes a lot of sense, yep. really. Having the entrance, uh, my opinion is it's pretty neat. It's a little bit flimsy, isn't it? Like the plastic's a little bit bendy in places. The parts that break apart feel a little bit unstable, you know? <laughs> but I'm not, I'm not just all out bagging it. I think it's really, it is quite cool. And it does what it's supposed to do, which is just be an entrance. Kids play with it. They relive the any moments that they want from either the past or from now. And you can have fights out the front, fights out the back, and, uh, and hours of fun. I think it's a lot of fun. It's cool if you want to use it as a display piece. Also fun if you're using it to play with, mm. to build up the excitement for your next match. If you guys like it, let us know down below. Don't forget to thumbs up our video. Subscribe to the channel for weekly videos. We're out of here for now, right? Yep. But there'll be a rematch, brother!